before, after, today I will show you how you can make your Apex Legends look better with Nvidia filter. But before, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and follow me on Instagram. Open Apex Legends, but first you have to install Nvidia Experience. If you haven't already installed it, look at the whole video. If you have already installed it, you can skip to this minute. Here you have to select your product type, then your product series, your product, operating system, select your windows, download type, select game ready driver, and language, select English, then press here on search, press on download, press on download again, and it will download here. When it is done, press on it, and press on open, minimize Chrome, then this page will pop up, press OK, wait a few seconds, then this page will pop up. Here you have to check NVIDIA Graphics Driver and GeForce Experience. Then press on Agree and Continue. Check Express. Press Next. Wait a few seconds. Uncheck Create Desktop Shortcut for NVIDIA GeForce Experience. Check Launch NVIDIA GeForce Experience and press on Close. Here you have to log in. Check Automatically Optimize Newly Added Games and Applications. Press on Skip and all your game will appear here. First you have to go to the settings. Scroll down to in-game overlay. Make sure you have this on, to activate the NVIDIA filter, then press on home. Open Apex Legends, press Alt plus Z or Y, for me it is Alt plus Z. To open up this page, press on game filter. You will have it on off. Select one. Now to make this filter, press here on add filter. First you have to add brightness and contrast. On the exposure, select 21%. Contrast, select minus 28%. Highlights, select 31%. Shadows, select 29%. And Gamma, select minus 18%. Minimize it, then add color. On the tint color, select 0%. Tint intensity, select 10%. Temperature, select 0. And Vibrance, select 0. Add Colorblind. On the Protonopia, select 10%. Deuteronopia, select 9%. And Tritonopia, select 0%. Then add Depth of Field. On the Focus Depth, select 100%. Far Blur Curve, select 0%. Near Blur Curve, select 0%. Blur Radius, select 0%. Invert Depth Z Axis, select On. And Invert Depth Y Axis, select Off. Then add Details. On the Sharpen, select 34%. Clarity, select 100%. HDR Toning, select 0%. And Bloom, select 0%. Then press here on done, and that's all you had to do. I hope you found this useful. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next episode. Bye.